I think what people really might not appreciate is that when you're smoking, that all of the chemicals that are in cigarette smoke, and there's like 4,000 chemicals, and we know about 50 of those are carcinogens. And so what they might not appreciate is that those chemicals don't just sit in your lungs, but in fact, your lungs are where the blood supply goes to your lungs, and those chemicals can get out in, into the blood supply and circulate to all sorts of organs of your body. And they can affect the cells in other organs just like they do affect the cells in your lungs. And so one of the questions that we wanted to ask was, first of all, what are the effects of cigarette smokes? And, and we uh, focused on one specific carcinogen in cigarette smoke. What are the effects of that on breast cancer? And in addition to that, we added a little extra twist in that we asked, does it affect breast cancer differently throughout life? So we looked at mice as they were moving through development. So looking at baby mice, mice in puberty, adolescence, young adulthood, and then um, during pregnancy and lactation or feeding the babies. And surprisingly, what we've found so far is that the mice that are going, like are in puberty and young adulthood, they are more susceptible to developing breast cancers later in life if they're exposed to the carcinogens in cigarette smoke.